I remember when I first came here, it was like a little difficult to meet new people. And it was like really daunting because we're going to a state school. So we know a good amount of people, but a vast majority of the people that we met here, we didn't know who they were. So how do you approach like making friends and getting into the circles? If that's tough. No. Yeah, definitely. So many people, when they go to a state school, like I feel like some people go with friends who are like currently from high school and like, Looking like back at it, I know that, you know, you go to the state school with your friends, but also I like, you know, want to caution people, you know, you got to meet new people. You have to meet these, you know, different environments and cultures. So even though it's nice to have your high school friends to rely on because you have previous connections, you just got to, you know, put yourself out there. And in the case of like antisocial kids or people who, you know, don't want to communicate, just try new things like you have so many interests, you know, if you like gaming, go to gaming club. If you like to play chess, go to chess club. There's so many clubs on like the OSU campus that you can just meet people of like different cultures and values. If you like like hackathons, yeah, come to hackathon club, come to hackathon (laughs) club every Tuesday, you know, we provide it. It's great. Yeah. Um, I think that's a great point. Clubs seem to be where I've made a good chunk of my friends as well. Um, you know, when it came to like the CS community, I feel like a good chunk of the people that I consider my friends now are from that community. Uh, pulling up to clubs like ACM or uh, App Development Club really helped uh, boost my networking and connections here. Mm-hmm. Um, and yeah, and then there's like fun clubs. There's like a Super Smash Bros. club and like yeah. there's like a ping pong club, I'm sure. You there's know? a ton um, of clubs out like at OSU.